while it would seem there's more wicked pedophilia coming from the Society of Satanism, a.k.a. the Jesuits. It says here on this article, Nine Jesuit priests with ties to Shervy, Shiv, Shervport, I'll put it that way, on lists of accused abusers. The Jesuits, a Roman Catholic religious order, on Friday released the list, released the list of priests they believe, I'm not good at reading on a computer, they believe committed sexual abuse of children, including nine who were assigned to Shervport. Hope I'm saying that right. Six worked at Jesuit High School, Shirv, oh, the Jesuit High School, Shirvport, which is now Leola College Prep. Three were assigned to St. John's Parents Parish, Co Cathedral. It has been decades since the majority of the men were here, and all but one have died. Yeah, and the ones that died are in hell now, because Roman Catholic. There's no salvation inside the Roman Catholic Church. The Roman Catholic Church is the is a ticket to hell. But not going to go off on that. Priests who worked at the Jesuit High School, the years of their assignments had the outcome of the investigations. And, you know, gives the list there. Priests assigned to St. John's uh, Parish, Co Cathedral, gives the list there. Uh, removed from ministry in 1998, removed from ministry in 2002. The Jesuits did not sp uh, specify whether the alleged abuse occurred during the priest's time here. Roman Catholic dioceses around the country in recent months have begun releasing the names of priests credibly accused of sexual abuse. Yeah, these Roman Catholic um, pagan temples, they always apologize, but they don't repent. They're always apologies, 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 but never repentance for their wicked pedophilia, which they picked up from the pagan Romans and Greeks. In November, Shear of Port, diocese said no allegations of sexual abuse have been received here since June 1986. Any allegations before that will be released by the Diocese of Alexandria, which says it has not complicated its review, or completed its review. Earlier today, the Diocese of Shreveport learned from, it, from the Jesuit supervisors of U.S. Central and Southern Province, province, which includes the state of Louisiana, of their priests and brothers accused of sexual abuse of minors in the parish and school or the minister, the Diocese of Shreveport said in a statement on their website, a priest or brother's assignment in the Diocese of Shreveport, Shreveport does not mean any allegations stem from their uh, any allegations stem from their assignment there. If there are any credible allegations of the Diocese of Shreveport, I'll be notified of those names, and with the names from the Diocese of Alexandria. I'm not good at reading this. Good grief. Um, the names of 42 priests in several parts of the country were made public on Friday. And then it goes down there. But, again, this kind of pedophilia is common because the Roman Empire, the Greeks, which is Roman Catholicism, is just a continuation of the pagan Greek and Roman religion. It's a it's borrowing that sexual perversion from the pagan Romans and Greeks. Now, what does the Bible say about this kind of wicked child abuse and sexual perversion. Matthew chapter 18 verse 6. But whoso shall offend one of these little ones which believe in me, it were better for him that a millstone were hanged around his neck, about his neck, and that he were drowned in the depths of the sea. Matthew chapter 18 verse 14. Even so it is not the will of your Father which is in heaven that one of these little ones should perish. Jesus Christ strongly condemns wicked pedophilia that comes from the satanic Jesuit order and the wicked Roman Catholic Antichrist papacy. He condemns it, and the Roman Catholic priesthood is an abomination. So don't be deceived by this wickedness that goes on. It is not Christian, okay? Roman Catholicism has nothing to do with Christianity. It's a pagan, it's just pagan Roman religion repackaged. And again, pagan Roman religion has pedophilia as part of their lifestyle. So don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.